Did you know that your Echo Dot has random morning greetings? Up and at em. Rise and shine. Good day sunshine. What's up early bird? Time to get that one. Carpe diem. Good morning. Looking good. Top of the morning to you. Your device also has welcome home greetings. Welcome home. I hope you're having a good day. Well, hello. I'm very happy you're here. Welcome home. It's nice to have you here. Hello and welcome. I'm Bud and I present instructional videos about smart home automation and also I do home related DIY repairs. If these topics are of interest to you, be sure to smash that subscribe button. Today, I'll show you a couple of easy routines that you can set up on your Echo devices. These routines will enable Echo greetings in the morning and also when you arrive home in the evening. Let's do this. Today's video is part of a series of how-to videos wherein I provide you guidance for the setup of routines within your Echo devices. To enable this ability within your devices, you must give Alexa access to your smart things. In the video link that you'll find above, I provide step-by-step -step instructions to enable the smart things skill within your Echo devices. Once this setup is complete, you then may have Echo announce the status of various home automations. One example of this is the routine that I created for my garage door. When my garage door opens or closes, the Echo device advises me of the status of the door. The two routines that I'll guide you through today will enable a random greeting in the morning and a welcome home greeting upon your return in the evening. Both of these routines take into account that we have music playing on our Echo Dots throughout the day. Therefore, the routines are set to pause the music source prior to each Echo announcement and resume the music following the greeting. In a previous video, I provide guidance on a routine that auto starts and auto stops your favorite music source or radio station through your Echo device. There is a link above if you have interest in this video. Let's get into today's routine. So I'm gonna go ahead and start by going into the Alexa app. And to access routine, you wanna click on the three lines in the upper left-hand corner. And then go down to the fourth item, which is routines. Okay, and we're gonna add a new routine. We're gonna call it morning greeting. So morning greeting. Okay, next we wanna go down to when this happens. We're gonna click on that plus sign. This is gonna be our trigger. And for our trigger, we're gonna click on the smart home. And the smart home device that we're gonna rely on as a trigger is our motion sensor in the kitchen. So I'm gonna select kitchen sensor. And I want it to be triggered whenever motion is detected between certain times in the morning. So go ahead and hit next. And we're gonna change any time. Uh, we're gonna leave it every day, uh, but we want to restrict the morning greeting between, uh, let's say, 6 and 7 a.m. So I'm gonna move this to 6 in the a.m. And we're gonna stop it at 7 in the a.m. So six to seven. The next thing I want to do is I want to put a duration on this. I don't want it to be saying good morning every time it senses motion. That could get uh, annoying. So I want to limit her from saying this, say no more than every 15 minutes. So we'll go down to 15. So it'll be suppressed for at least 15 minutes. That way, if I arrive and then 15 minutes or 20 minutes later my wife arrives, she'll get a morning greeting as well. We'll hit next here. All right, then we wanna add some actions. So as you may recall, I wanna shut off the music and then up the volume a little bit so that uh, she can announce the morning greeting, then return the volume and uh, start the music back up again. So our first action is to uh, change device settings to stop audio 
and we want to do that on the kitchen echo dot so we'll select that and hit next so it confirms there that it would stop the audio next action I want to increase the volume so we go to device settings to do that and I want to bring the volume up to about level 7 I would say we'll hit next now the next action that I want to take is to have her say the greeting so Alexa says good morning so we'll select good morning and it says Alexa will tell you something new and fun every day so she kind of mixes it up and gives you a different phrase each day so we'll hit next okay and then once she has said the phrase the next action I want to add is to reduce that volume before I start playing music. So we'll go to device settings to do that. And we'll take the volume down to about level two. Hit next. And then we just need to resume the music. So the action is to select music in the list. And this is where you can select an artist or a song playlist. We're going to say K Love. And the provider for K-Love is iHeartRadio. We'll hit next. So we just need to change the order of a few of these. Sometimes they get switched around. We're going to move this up. And in a previous video, I explained that if you press and hold those two lines next to the action, you can drag uh, into the correct order. We also want this volume seven up here and the volume two we want to move down after the statement that Alexa says. So the sequence is stop the audio, set volume to seven, do the good morning greeting, set volume back to two, and then resume playing the K Love station. I want to do all this from the kitchen echo dot. And then all we need to do is go up and save this, and it's all ready to go. So we have good morning greeting. I'm not going to go through all the steps on Bud arrives home, but I will show you the sequence. So I've called this routine Bud arrives home. And this routine uses uh, my smart things devices, but it uses my iPhone. I've set my iPhone up as a present sensor. If you want to know how to do that, I do have a video and I'll leave a link above so you can check that out. Once you get your device set up as a present sensor, you can have it detect your arrival at home. And this does this by the geofence. So once uh, my phone is detected, it'll be the trigger that starts this routine. And the first thing will happen is that I have a delay in here. So you can go into the device settings and I'll show you here and you can put in a duration of how long you want it to delay. So it delays for a minute and 30 seconds. Once that's done, it'll stop audio on the kitchen echo dot. Uh, it'll set the volume to seven. Then it'll have Alexa give me the welcome home greeting. Then it'll set the volume back to two and it'll resume playing the radio station on iHeartRadio and all this is executed on the Kitchen Echo Dot. So that's pretty easy and straightforward, and that way you can get a good morning greeting as well as a greeting when you arrive back at home. In upcoming videos in this series, I will guide you through creating echo routines that will enable your devices to notify you when family member arrives or departs from a specific destination, and also to get an echo notification whenever one of your motion detectors senses movement. If you would like to be notified of these upcoming videos, all you need to do is hit that subscribe button and click on that notification bell. If you found today's video helpful, it would help my channel if you could give the video a thumbs up and also if you could share the video with a friend. If you have questions about today's content or if you have suggestions for future content, just place them in the comments section below. A special thank you for joining me today, and we'll see you next time.